<laughs> All right, I'm here with Dawu Anya Buile. And I am Lilia, the Pass with the Pass Report. This brother is Mr. Brother Man. Tell us, tell us a little bit about this event now. Um, well, what's going on now is uh, we're just having a prelude to the Brother Man um, relaunch uh, party for tomorrow night. So this is just to give people an opportunity to come mix and mingle, meet myself and my brother, who's the writer, and the rest of the Big City Entertainment team. Um, the show's going to make this comic book. For the comic book, once we came up with the concept and sat down with my brother Guy, um, the concept ended up outshining the airbrush t-shirts. And at that time, I had already been airbrushing since 84, you know, so like six years. So I wanted to get out of airbrushing. And then I, we ended up going into the comic business. But that wasn't my intention, would be really part of the industry, which we're still not. We, in, we influence industry, but we're still not part of the industry. So there's a lot that actually went on from that time when we first came out with the book. And we, within that four year span, with 11 issues out, we did 750,000 books on our own, independently. Wow, now so, that, so, you are, you, so you all are still independent now? Yes. Okay, wonderful. And you know, I, I want to know, I'm sure some of the viewers would want to know, but I think it's so interesting that you uh, create, especially African American, uh, uh, images of these uh, uh, superheroes. You know, we, we become superheroes, and, and I really like that, but how do you come up with that? Where, how do you envision these characters? How do you come up with them? Well, a lot of times, it, it's hard for me to tell people the, the source. I just tell people, you know, I'm a creator for the, I mean, a vessel for the creator, where concepts jump in my head on a daily. And when I think about my, my history um, growing up, you know, my father was an activist. If you look at issue number 10, um, Brother Man's parents, my brother and I modeled them after our parents. If I had an allegiance for, to the mainstream, I think this never would have happened because my mind would have been basically took. But because I was never really into the comics, it allowed me to see the things that my father was teaching me and the things that I picked up elsewhere and fusing that with science fiction. So where can, uh, where can we pick up these comic books, these Brother Man comic books, and uh, what is the website and the information that people can contact you directly? Uh, BrotherManComics.com. The, if you go there, that will give you all the information. And we just now came out with the trade paperback, which is 300-page, three-volume set book. Um, we just now started hitting stores, so pretty soon it's going to be at a store near you. But it means I can go to the website the creator of Brother Man. We want to thank you for your time. And uh, again, stay positive. This is the La Paz Report Media that speaks the positive truth. I'm Lilia DePaz. We'll see you next time.